knowing your vehicle's towing capacity is a critical aspect of RVing and towing trailers and everything like that. Hall Gauge was nice enough last year to have us review their product, which we've loved and we've used a ton, and they just came out with a new app for the phone. This new app is called the GVWR app, Gross Vehicle Weight Rating app, and it will help you determine what your tow vehicle is actually capable of. So let's go through the app and see how it does. About to leave, already packing. Come with me, I'm not really asking. We'll get away to a place where we don't know. First thing you need to do for the GVWR app is go to your app store if you have an Apple device like me or however you do it on your Samsung or whatever. Type in GVWR in the search and it pulls right up. Just go ahead and click open. I've already downloaded it. You'll have to download it. You know how to do all that. Okay. And your main screen comes up. It has two already programmed in kind of like test um, or a beta versions uh, of a 2020 F-150 with maximum payload capacity and maximum tow. Once I've got logged in, I am going to go through and program in our truck. So you need to come up with a name for whatever rig it's going to be. For this one, it's going to be like and subscribe. Now that I have that, I can go ahead and click on it and we can start entering ratings. Once you get the name put in, then you need to put in your vehicle's gross vehicle weight rating. So for our truck, it's located right here. Our gross vehicle weight rating, if it zooms in enough that you can actually see it, either way, is 11,500. Our GVWR is 11,500 pounds. The next thing it's asking for is our max cargo weight, which says right on the sticker above it, 3,577 pounds. After entering our vehicle weights, now it is for our gross combined weight rating. This is the part that's a little bit tough because that's not on our stickers here. You can look in your manual. You can also look online. I already looked online and our gross combined vehicle weight rating for this truck is 28,700 pounds. That's truck trailer maxed out everything in ideal situations more than would ever do but um that's what it can carry so i'm going to go ahead and enter that for my gross combined weight rating 8,700 pounds and continue now i need to select whether i'm going to be towing a bumper pull or a gooseneck on our fifth well trailer our gvwr is 11,500 so I'll go ahead and enter that. Continue. And now our max trailer carrying our cargo capacity. For most trailers, the max cargo weight will be listed on the door or just inside the door. But on our 2008 Carriage Domani, I don't know where the stickers went to. So I had to get online and look it up in the owner's manual online. And it has a 2,000 pound uh, payload capacity or cargo weight. So I'm going to en enter that in. That gives my trailer a 9,500 pound dry weight, which is what we've came up with on the cat scales before, or right around there. Truck is about 8,000 pounds, 8,073, and that's with one person in it. Because we've weighed in with haul gauge before, I know that we are just short of 8,200 pounds, so I can go ahead and adjust this. Now that I have everything programmed in, I can look and it tells me what my pin weight would be, just empty as it is right now, about 1,900 pounds. Then I can take and slide, and as I add more weight to the trailer, it'll tell me what my pin weight should be. So when I get to the point that I'm at my 12,000 pounds for my max trailer load, that's all this trailer should have in it by the specifications, that is giving me a pin weight of 2,400 pounds. Now, my truck can handle at 3,500 pounds of payload, 
and it'll go all the way up to 11,500 for the gross vehicle weight rating. And this with 2,400 pound pin weight when my trailer's maxed out, takes me to 10,473, leaving me over a thousand pounds of payload capacity overall with my truck still towing this trailer. Now with my old Dodge, the Ram 2500, that payload was like 2180 or something like that. I, I mean, it's been a few years. I can't remember off the top of my head, but because of that, this trailer fully loaded would overweigh it. Now, most of the time we don't have water, all that, so it was right at that border point. But with this app, I can now know exactly where I should be. Knowing the weights of your tow vehicle, the vehicles you're towing, cargo, all that sort of stuff is extremely important. And Hall Gauge and their new GVWR app is an amazing way for you to keep track of where you're at with your weights. None of us want to be responsible for an accident because we are overloaded and none of us want insurance to say we aren't covering you because you overloaded your vehicle or you weren't loaded properly, those sort of things. This is yet another way that we can be safe and make sure that we are towing within the capabilities of our vehicle. And this will work for any vehicle, whether it's a 2019 F-350 or a, well, I don't know if a 2008 Ford Fusion will work, but I mean, Theoretically, a 2008 Ford Fusion. It has a payload of like 150 pounds. So, if you get a chance, go ahead and download the GVWR app. It is awesome. We have loved it so far. I can't wait to use it this weekend going down to Lake Powell and all those sort of things. Just another way to keep us safe on the road and make sure that we are towing within the capabilities of our truck. Comment down below if you've used All Gauge or if you're interested in it. I, I'm more than happy to answer questions about it. Please like and subscribe, it really helps us out, and as always, 